sport you can count on continues with Glenn Marini's Sports Report. Up in Waterloo, the tides are turning. Last season, the DeKalb Barons winning three games. That's more than DeKalb had won in the previous four seasons combined. Barons looking to build in 2015. Here's your Highland Zone countdown to kickoff preview. Bears on three. One, two, three. Bears! We kind of had to start from scratch. We're not starting from scratch anymore. We got some great senior leadership, and that's really reflecting in our practices so far. Last fall in Pete Kemp's first season, the Barons opened the year with wins over Angola and Garrett. Those victories helping to boost the confidence of a once proud program that comes into this season looking to replace seven starters on defense. Well, I think the focus for every defense is to stop the ball and get as many downs as possible. I like to say it's just our, steer, our sheer stopping power in that we uh, run to the ball everywhere. Kemp's making sure of that. And we're just getting through the lines just easily. Our heart and soul, Steve Alon, you know, he's returning, you know, all conference inside linebacker. We are deeper on the defensive line. We're not nearly as big, but we're a lot quicker. So we're really excited with what we can do. We have some newcomers on the defensive side of the ball that didn't play last year. They're going to start for us. So I'm excited to watch them play. Last year as a junior, DeKalb quarterback Harrison Price threw for just over 1,400 yards. 949 of those yards going to classmate Will Chrisman, a six foot seven receiver. Chrisman will be a big focal point for the Cal Barons again here in 2015. I had a pretty good season last year, and that comes from a lot of our offensive line, our running game, and definitely our quarterback, Harrison Price. And I think we have a lot of positives that we can build on this season. We got a lot of guys coming back. You know, we lost a lot of seniors, but I think we're still going to be just as strong as this year. I think what's going to really help us this year is our, our, our offensive line. We have three seniors on it, two returning. And that's what we're going to build ourselves around is our offensive line. So we're really excited about our skills positions this year because we are so much faster. And it just, it, it's going to, I hope it shows up on Friday night. Barons open the season next Friday night by hosting the Angola Hornets.